introduce two lovely ladies. Both are past winners of the Miss Universe crown. May I present first Miss Universe of 1964, the former Miss Grease, Corina Sope, now Mrs. Stephen Zacks. <laughs> And Miss Universe of 1969, a former Miss Philippines, Gloria Diaz. Oh, you're lovelier every year. Thank you, girls. Now, even though the girls in the 1972 Miss Universe pageant speak dozens of different languages, music is an international language they all know and love. And right now, while our 12 semifinalists get ready for the swimsuit competition, all of the other girls have a special musical treat for you. They'll be conducted by our maestro, Bernie Green, and they'll be joined by one of this island's outstanding young singing talents, Chucho Avellanet. Here they are, the Miss Universe International Medley. O meu lamento hoy, na desesperança hoy, encontrar preso em mundo o amor que eu perdi, na Bahia vou contar. To foot the bill, then the train's hard on the house calls. So I may we don't have no fuss. For after some consideration, we can stay. Consider yourself. What a through the rye and finicky lee finicky la a puzzlement but they stayed with it did you ever try eating a chorizo it's a south american spicy version of our american hot dog it's interesting to talk to the girls about the different foods of their countries but you soon learn that they don't taste very different than your own home cooking in germany for instance a hamburger is a deutsche's beefsteak miss israel's favorite food is filet and miss malaysia prefers saute those dishes may sound a little exotic, but if they produce figures like those, leave me to them. 
Well, it's time for the swimsuit competition, and I know that's one part of the show that nobody wants to miss. Let's just take a minute, and then we'll come back to the girls. In the meantime, here's why they always come back for more Duncan Hines cake. <laughs>